people such as Iggy, Illusion, BC, Germ, Austin, YBM, and stuff like that. We got a Ooh, lot. Yo, Mook taking out Wizro. Shouts to Mook. All so. right, so here we go. We were talking about it. This is a pay to play with Gibbous on the left, Rocking for Ninja. Uh, and uh, Cosmos, uh, like we saw earlier on stream, rocking uh, corn. And uh, I, I just want to apologize to the stream. My voice is shot after a uh, full day of commentating yesterday, so pardon me if my voice cracks a little bit. Let's get right into it. Uh, many people feel like uh, I, I heard uh, Greninja for the longest time described as the poor man's fox, but uh, not no longer. This character has a lot of tricks and a lot of... Uh, Foot, like crazy footstool locks as well. Definitely, there's a lot of people who are pioneering the character. A lot of people in Japan, a lot of, and then I studying in Europe, and a lot of people are starting to see the tech, and more and more Greninja players are coming out of the woodworks. Yeah, Gibbous one of the top players in uh, Dallas as well, and so uh, he will have fought Cosmos many, many times. So no, no matchup, uh, no lack of matchup knowledge in here. All right, so continuing on with this, the Dragon Lance is once again coming big into play here. Keeping Gibbous out. Just such a good move. Uh, good way to get pressure and uh, and like uh, very safe too if you miss it. They'll just retreat. Gibbous at that Arizona percent. We'll see if he makes some of it. Okay. Right. Right. Gibbous uh, himself, one of the players who's at various times been ranked number one in Dallas. So uh, curious to see what tricks he has up his sleeve. Nair, Nair beating the Dragon Lunch. Nice. Oh, a nice up smash. Something sideways off the string. Can you get the edge guard? Yeah, and it seemed like it beat out the Dragon Lunch. That's really cool. Oh, oh not dare to bear. Solid stuff from Gibbous. Right oh, that there's a pr optimal punish. I, th I thought he was just going to maybe run in and grab him or something or dash it. No, optimal punish. And that's the first damage he's taken since I talked about his percentage. <laughs> That entire string they just did to get that kill had not taken damage throughout yeah. it. Always in control. I like short hop dash grab, but not, not able to confirm it. Alright, keeping him out with that. Great grab! Alright, Dragon Run still making it work. I'm trying to catch him with these the big disjointed up air. He just falls out of it, doesn't, doesn't lunge. Dragons, but no lunge. There it is. That's not going to take the kill, though. Yeah, Gip still barely added any extra percentage, so it's still extremely close. Dragon, oh. dragon Lunge again. It's like a game of Pong right now, just matching back Woo! and forth. Aerial Dragon Lunge. And, and wow, trying to still stop takes him out. and just ends up dying in the blast zone barely. Yeah. Cosmos wants that move. Look good. Right, back to a completely even game between the two. Oh. There's on a shield. That was unsafe. One of these raw back airs coming out from, uh, from Cosmos here. Because not only does it have a huge uh, disjoint, but also it pushes you back in the direction you want to go. So it keeps you away from them. It's a very safe option. Absolutely. Oh, pays for that uh, water shirt. Another down throw. He's getting a, a bunch of free damage about this. Now it's his turn to get pressure to the ledge. Get something started. This is an extremely close game. Pretty dangerous to charge a smash attack at center stage there. Yes, but maybe maybe he's you know crazy like a fox. So. Cosmos got that Arizona percentage. Let's see if he can do what he did with Gibbous to him with it. Trying to tr going for that juggle. I really like the options for both of them. The great lunge, but an even better recovery for a high from. Uh, oh from man! Greninja. This drag lunge just covers so many options. Gibbous needs to start staying. In oh! Oh! Gets caught on the ledge. Invincibility frame is gone and just no. takes him out with no. that. Speaking of that Arizona percentage, that's what he wrapped it up at. No. Exactly. It's wow. a, it's strong, man. It's real strength. Cosmos looked great in that set. Gibbous had some good answers, but it, Cos Cosmos had even better. One thing I'm just noticing is that Gibbous isn't shielding. The lance is coming down. Shield Shielding is, is the best option because he cannot be able to grab. It's not a grand grab unless he hits you directly with it. Absolutely. But instead, he's rolling and then just getting hit because he's reacting to the roll. Yeah. It's a, it's a so, such a powerful move, and it just covers so much. Gosh. All right. I, here we are now. Omega Gamer with uh, one of the oddest cameras in the game on this stage. It's quite quite strange to me. That mom is really creepy in the background. Yeah. I, I, I'm glad that nobody interfered. No, no moms interfere here. <laughs> I've seen too many tournament sets on regular Gamer. Right, st strong opening, 50% here from uh, Gibbous. Unanswered until just now. The down tilt trying to lock him up with Four it. Four straight down tilts from Cosmos. Great cross up with the fair, but still gets hit by the dragon launch. Goes for it a second time. Nice. Finally, uh, Gibbous able to punish it. Chases him down with all these grabs. Oh, here comes the dares. 
not able to get the locks he wants. Good DI from Cosmos. This is huge damage from Cosmos. Huge strings. Yes, this finally not getting hit by that Lance. Not spacing it. Oh, uh, strange down smash. Okay. Cosmos below. Again, he pays for that big water shooter that he goes for. I'm liking how Cosmos is playing around that ledge there, making sure he kept Gibbous completely out from him. It was still fighting his way back in. You can tell Gibbous wants to be quite aggressive. Yeah, Cosmos is bailing. I want no part of that. Such a job Good control. grab. The spacing and the pacing of the match, just all of it is in his control right now. Even though he's not having center stage, he, he's, he's controlling exactly where Gibbous is going. Absolutely. Okay, it's fighting him out. So. Oh, wall nice, nice wall cling, yes. <laughs> not, not many bailing. characters can do that. All right, so... Oh, oh, great. Oh, that was amazing options. That, just the way he landed right on him and just total confidence to go with that forward smash. Complete call out and that's some a pretty solid lead there. Yeah, it's, it, it even seemed like Cosmos was trying to land with a hitbox, but didn't matter. Okay, now, la now last time Gibbs took the lead and added almost nothing before losing his own stock. Let's rolled, see what he can do this time. Rolled back, but was not punished off that luckily on his part. Okay, good good shirt, Good shuriken. I love it. This is what he needs to be doing. He's nice still that more. All right, here. So now, now he's had a little bit more success this time. Sparks, red lightning. Uh, still won't kill from dead center stage. No rage on Corin. Wall flanks. Ooh, that was cra That was crafty. But Cosmos was ready. I think the next one's probably gonna kill. I, I like how Cosmos went for that wall cling to maybe sucker him into thinking, oh, we won't have legend for somebody, but still it sucks it out. More grabs. Good damage. Reads the air dodge. Trying to get that up tilt. Grab that, that should kill. Yep. That yeah. Right. Solid stuff. 40% now for lead for Gibbous. Trying to fight his way. Oh, oh, oh no! Oh my. Oh my. And Cosmo oh. Yo, does not one. react. Press one, people. Yeah. They, they both looked so disappointed. Oh my god. Press one, people. <laughs> He's doing so well. He's <sighs> oh man. He's That's adapting. He's that is a. Knife in the heart. That That's, hurts. Oh man, you hate to see that happen. That was like, that was for top eight. That was instant. Like that was um, I, I, both and both games. Oh. He took the lead as well. Both games he had the first stock lead. That That's physically painful. <laughs> that is a punch in the gut, a stab in the oh. heart, a well, kick in the well, teeth. Hopefully, Gibbous climbs back into top eight through loser's side. You know, It'd be a shame. Like, I'm, I'm officially rooting for him. Exactly. Like that, It'd be a shame for him that, to go out that, on that. That karmic lightning bolt striking you down. I like just saying, no, not today. No, th not today is not your day. You know, Gibbous just didn't hold the door for someone this morning. <laughs> yeah. And just, then just that's that's what happened. Yeah. Just, just hold the door for people. Yeah. You know, just <laughs> be. <laughs> now, Gibbous. I'm just still. I'm a still. Nice guy. That, that's that's rough. That hurts. That is definitely. That is super difficult. Brutality. Um, I believe he is going to have to. I'm not really sure where he who's going to have to face. I think the winner of Arrow Link and Esam is what he has to fight. So that's pretty rough. Yeah. Oof. Good luck to Gibbous. I hope he he makes it back in because that is what a way to go out. Yeah. Uh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, it's it's brutal. I I think we are we're waiting on the last winners quarters match. Yes. Uh, which should be Zero and MJG. Oh yes. So that should be a great set. I, I'm curious to see uh, who uh, he plays against Villager. Whether it's his Sheik, uh, it's his Diddy, or maybe even his Cloud. If I had to guess, I think he might go with Sheik, but Diddy's the comfort pick of all, uh, all at all times. Yeah, absolutely. But I think because uh, they're, they're not going to be playing, it's going to be really hard to get a Villager in a position where you're getting kills. really just playing the percent game. And she's much better playing the percent game than Diddy Kong is. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. And uh, an increase in speed, uh, a projectile that can go through his like just hit with multiple projectiles. Yes, yeah, certainly. Yeah. Needle gimps on the balloons. I think she could be the more optimal choice. But we'll see what he ends up picking. Yeah, I, I know that. Uh, he, I, I feel like his Sheik is uh, fall. It used to be the other way. Like his uh, Diddy was his fun pick, but Sheik was his like I, I need to win pick. And now I feel like it's kind of the opposite. 